Hi, in this video, I'll show you how to create torn paper effect in PowerPoint 2013. I am Ram Gopal from Prezotraining.com, a site that provides creative presentation ideas for trainers. The torn paper effect you will learn to create today looks like this. It is very easy to create these beautiful graphics and let me show you how to do so from scratch. The first thing I'm going to do is to go to a new slide and I'm going to go to Auto Shapes menu. Under Rectangles, I'm going to pick up this tool called as the Rectangle tool and I'm going to create a rectangular bar. Then I'm going to create the holes that make this torn paper effect possible. For that, all I need is to go to Auto Shapes menu. First, under Basic Shapes, I need to pick up this tool called as Oval tool. I'm going to hold the shift button down as I draw a circle. So this is the hole. Then there is the torn effect. So let us go to Auto Shapes menu, go to Rectangles and draw a rectangle right next to that circle. Now I'm going to select both the shapes together. Go to Arrange, Align and say Align Middle so they are properly aligned. Then I'm going to go to Format merge shapes and I'm going to say union. Now I'm going to keep this right here and I'm going to hold the shift button down as I click and drag from the corners to adjust the size. So that is pretty decent. Now I'm going to go to shape fill and say white fill and let us go to shape outline and say no outline. Now this might be slightly bigger than what I want, so maybe I can make it even smaller. I'm going to press Ctrl D, which is the shortcut for duplicate. And I'm going to hold the Ctrl button pressed down as I hit on D as many times as I want because I literally want this edge to be having these holes completely uh, covering, them, covering them. So let me take the last one here and place it right along the edge. Then I'm going to click and drag all these. I'm going to hold the shift button down and click on this so I can deselect it. So I've selected all these uh, shapes. Let us go to Home tab, Arrange, Align and say Align Left. Then let us go to Arrange, Align and say Distribute Vertically. Now when I click outside, you can see that this is the effect that I'm looking for. It looks pretty beautiful, isn't it? Now let us select all of them and let us go to format merge shapes and say subtract. That's it. Now you have the torn paper effect. Isn't that beautiful? Now, if you want to have a version that lies horizontal like this one, all you need to do is to press control D to make a duplicate and then hold this to turn it around or go to home, arrange, rotate and say rotate right 90 degrees and here we have the lateral version of this torn paper. In the example that I showed earlier, I showed you these kind of interesting effects on the paper and they make the paper look so very attractive. So how did I achieve that? It's very simple. All I did was to fill these shapes with those pictures. Yes, you can have pictures with such beautiful textures available on the internet in public domain sites. You just need to select them, copy, go back to this particular shape that you want to fill it, right click, format shape, go to fill, go to uh, picture or texture fill option and then click on clipboard. That's it. Now your page has uh, this beautiful torn paper effect and these lines and everything which look really attractive. Now to fill this with another texture, all I need to do is to go here, pick this particular picture and put it in the clipboard. For that, all I need to do is to right click and say copy. Now this texture is in the clipboard. Now I go back to the shape, then go to fill option, go to picture or texture fill and click on clipboard. That's it. Now I have a beautiful texture for the lateral version of the torn paper. So that is how you create torn paper effect in PowerPoint 2013. Now I'm going to show you some example templates taken from our complete trainers bundle where we have tons of assets including note papers, torn papers, sticky notes, etc. And take a look at some of the options here. Now these ones of course are created entirely by us. 
uh, so you can see that these lines are all drawn by us it is not like it is uh, taken from any texture so that gives you a little more uh, option for you to edit the graphic in the way that you want so this is one example from complete trainers bundle and this is another way in which you can have um, a different effect to showcase some text like in this case we have spiral notebooks this is another version of a spiral notebook you can write your text here on the left hand and to the right you can see actually that there is uh, almost a feeling that it is an open book and this is the front page of uh, the book and you can have any title that you want and this one is about contents of notebook you can actually use this to talk about two sides of the argument i hope you liked the torn paper effect i taught you in this video if you like the effect then you will really love the options that are available in free snackable powerpoint course in prezotraining.com free snackable powerpoint course is a series of 16 super short emails with 30 second powerpoint tips and tricks that you can literally learn apply and then impress your bosses colleagues and audience if you are a trainer or a business presenter it is almost silly to miss this course so click here and start your free course right away I'll see you on the inside.